Okay, so, uh, true story. Katie Hopkins went to South Africa to make a documentary about the plight of the white man. Yeah, she did that. Uh, it was actually the white farmer. Uh, and they tried to deport her for hate speech. And uh, on her way to the airport, she uh, had an accident and dislocated her shoulder. The ambulance turned up and pumped her full of ketamine as an <laughs> anesthetic. <laughs> this is a true story. Uh, the journalist <laughs> at The Guardian, who deserves a medal, wrote an article called A-Hole in a K-Hole. <laughs> so I wrote a poem about it. <laughs> this is A-Hole in a K-Hole. My name is Katie Olivia Hopkins. That's Katie Hopkins to you. I'm famous for my casual racism and my not so casual racism too. I'm an elite member of the Shitterati Arentagob shit stirring witch. I'm a toxic Twitter twat, a relentless UKIP bitch. What people don't know about me is on a recent trip to South Africa making a documentary about the plight of the white man I know, right? What am I like? A whole new side to me has surfaced because behind closed doors, I'm actually a diehard Guardian reader with a quality on my mind as I chomp on smashed avocado and I sip on nut milk flat whites. 30 minutes of Bikram yoga and a gong bath to boot and I'm ready to take on the world. I'm a bleeding heart liberal. I love the NHS. Behind closed doors, I'm all like, free movement for everyone. EU forever. Jeremy Corbyn for prime minister. I've got Nicola Sturgeon on speed dial. Me and the Sturge, we go way back in public. I'm like, all I heard was whiskey haggis, whiskey haggis, those bloody scars got sponge enough of taxpayers' money, but IRL, me and the Sturge, we holiday in centre parks at least once a year. She's a hoot in a tailored skirt suit. What a woman. I go to pride marches in disguise. I'm all like, hey, you gays. I am what I am, well, so am I. I'm a lefty liberal with freedom on my mind. I volunteer at a food bank every Friday under the pseudonym Stacey Dobkins. I don't like guns. Piers Morgan's a grade A wanker. See you next Tuesday, Morgan. Oh. What's this? I've only had a phone call from Lord Sugar's assistant. Looks like someone's had a rethink. Is he going to hire me? Is he going to fire me? I shift uneasy in my swivel chair. The anticipation's frizzing up my bleach blonde hair. And Alan just glares at me. And in slow motion, he begins to point. <sighs> Hi. Sorry, what? No, you're high, Hopkins. Look at the bloody state of you. You're bloody high. It's then I realize that something isn't right. And then everything turns from day to night. And it's just me sitting in the boardroom. I'm high. I'm high. Oh, I'm high. And it's then the K-hole that had swallowed me whole starts to fall away. And all the racist tweets I've ever tweeted swirl around and hug me like a doovie on a winter's day. Old friends, how I've missed you. I've been stuck in a left-wing nightmare, a prison of progress and hopes and dreams and a free education and a thriving NHS. Get me out of here and back to Brexit Britain where I will reign as a new self-appointed people's princess. And I will take my throne at the fiery gates of hell, which is either Dover or the security border at Luton Airport. A hole in a K-hole, I know, I know this is serious, yeah. A hole in a K-hole, I know, I know she makes me fucking furious. A hole in a K-hole, I think. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, we'd appreciate it if you could hit the like button, if you could hit the subscribe button and make sure to ring that bell icon so you don't miss any updates from us in the future. If you want to go that extra mile and support us a little further, we do have a Patreon channel with loads of exclusive goodies and you can sign up for as little as a dollar a month. We appreciate your help guys and hopefully we'll see you again soon.